Guys, don't make these 10 health mistakes. Ditch the dock. You already know you need to drop a few pounds and cut back on the beer and potato chips. Besides, you feel fine. Men are geniuses when it comes to finding reasons not to see the doctor. But one of the most important things you can do for your health is schedule, and show up for, a regular visit. Think you can't have a heart attack. The big one is something most guys worry about for their dad or granddad. But the threat is often there for much younger men. If heart disease runs in your family, it could find you as early as your 30s. No matter what your age is, make it a point to take care of your ticker. Ignore the snore. Sighing logs at night. About half of guys who snore have something called obstructive sleep apnea. It does more than just annoy the person next to you. This disorder can make you stop breathing for a few seconds. It's also linked to heart disease and high blood pressure. Skip the sunscreen. We're not just talking about golf or beach days. You should slather on a product with an SPF 30 or higher every time you go outside to prevent skin cancer. Most guys never put it on their faces, or any other exposed skin. Protect yourself, refuse to get help for impotence. Don't be ashamed. Bedroom problems have nothing to do with your masculinity. Chances are they aren't caused by your state of mind, either. The main cause of impotence is usually a lack of blood flow to the penis. This can also be a sign of heart trouble, so put your pride aside and see the doc. Drink away the blues. More women than men get depressed. That's part of the problem, the idea that it's a female problem often keeps the more than 6 million men who have it from seeking help. As a result, more guys turn to drugs and alcohol to help them feel better. This just makes depression that much harder to spot and treat. Go with the flow. How many times have you gone to the bathroom today? Really, who has time to keep track? Maybe you should. If you go more than 8 times a day or more than twice at night, it could be more than a nuisance. It could be a sign of a medical problem like enlarged prostate, overactive bladder, OAB, or even some forms of cancer. Talk to your doctor about it. Keep your mouth shut. In the US, women are more likely than men to get routine dental checkups. But guys need to see the dentist regularly, too. Not only because they can spot and prevent oral problems, but sitting back and saying ah can also reveal symptoms of things like diabetes, Crohn's disease, lupus, and even leukemia. Stick with meat and potatoes. It's a rare guy who gets enough fruits and vegetables during the day. Doctors suggest 4 to 5 servings of each for a heart-healthy diet. If that's not enough, eating the good stuff also lowers the odds that you'll have a stroke, cancer, or digestive problems. And it keeps your blood sugar in check, tempt fate. Some guys just love to drink, smoke, gamble, drive fast, or jump out of planes. Sure these things are fun, but all of them can be bad for your health. Truth is, men are more likely than women to do all these things. Why? Some guys do drink more, which messes with their judgment. Others just spend less time worrying about the outcome of their actions. Sometimes, it pays to think twice.